Hey, it's Luxury Travel Docs here, and welcome to Buenos Aires, Argentina. We arrived here three nights ago, and we stayed at the Park Hyatt Hotel in the Ricoleta neighborhood of Buenos Aires. We boarded the Viking Jupiter yesterday, and we had an all-day tour of Buenos Aires today. We were on the maiden voyage of Viking Jupiter after the pandemic where we went to Iceland and did the itinerary called Iceland's Natural Beauty in July of 2021. Just a reminder that all proceeds from our channel are donated to charity. Please help us help others by giving us a thumbs up or subscribing to our channel. Your support makes a difference. So let's get to it. Today we are going to look at cabin 6020, a penthouse junior suite that is compliant with the American Disabilities Act, or as many of us would call it, handicap accessible. There are only two ADA cabins on the Viking Jupiter, and both of them are located on deck six forward. This particular cabin is on the port side. Fortunately, we are invited by Viking to tour one of these cabins so that we may bring a review to you. Upon entering the cabin, you'll notice that there is a lot of privacy for most of your room from the hallway. Compared to the deluxe veranda cabin that we brought to you previously, this particular cabin has 50% more square footage, priority shore excursion and dining reservations, as well as a welcome bottle of champagne. The design of the room is very spacious. Probably the first thing you will notice is that it has the same square footage as a penthouse junior suite with less furniture. It also has modern design elements as well as soft color palettes. The beds can be arranged either in a king fashion or as two twins. If you're someone who has discomfort when sleeping while traveling, make sure you ask your room steward for a feather mattress topper. One of the best features of all Viking Ocean cabins is the private veranda. This particular veranda is accessible via a ramp at the sliding glass door. There is also a small pane glass window that you can use to view the outdoors while sitting in a chair or at the desk. Use this veranda as a perfect space for enjoying a morning coffee or have a glass of champagne while you watch the sunset or watch wildlife go by. Of course, the veranda has two chairs and a table. The view from this cabin is unobstructed above and below. There is a slight overhang to give you some shade when outside on the veranda. Chay's lounges are located in other cabins, which we will review for you as well. With the location of this cabin, you'll have peace and quiet because there are cabins above and below you and no public spaces above or below you. The verandas are private, but if you're traveling as a group and have adjacent cabins, ask your room steward to open up the dividers between the balconies. Just inside the veranda is a shortened desk that is compatible with a wheelchair. In the ADA cabins, the television is located above the desk, which is located opposite the bed. The refrigerator is in the other side of the desk, and it has soft drinks, liquor and snacks that are replenished daily in this category of cabin. Viking has Coca-Cola products and liquors include Smirnoff, Beef Eaters, Dewars, and Bacardi. Ask your cabin steward if you would like something different. A carafe of filtered water and two glasses are replenished daily. Your quiet Vox transmitters are located on the desk and should be plugged in daily to make sure they are charged for all of your tours. Personally, we really like using our Airfly Pro so that we may use our Bluetooth enabled headphones. We like the Pro best because we're able to each use our own Bluetooth enabled headphones and pair it with one quiet Vox box. Individuals with Bluetooth-enabled hearing aids may find the AirFly device useful. 
There are two U.S. and two European Union outlets located at the desk. One of the EU outlets is occupied by your quiet box charger. There is a lighted vanity mirror as well as storage and your binoculars located at the desk. This is not a magnifying mirror and personally we bring a suction cup magnifying mirror so that we may attach it to the mirror in the bathroom or occasionally to the sliding glass doors. In this particular cabin, there is a small coffee table located in front of a chair by the veranda. In every room is a catalog of the art collection that you can see around the ship. There is free Wi-Fi, although the connection speed definitely varies during every voyage. The 42-inch flat-screen TV features MSNBC, Fox News, National Geographic, and so much more. We love the on-demand features of the Viking television, including the enrichment lectures, your guest speakers, and many more recorded programs that are applicable to most of the sailings. Next to each bed is a reading lamp, as well as light and night light switches. We bet you didn't know that you could push this little button and turn on the night lights in the bathroom as well as the room. One EU, one US, and two USB outlets are located in each nightstand. There is plenty of storage in each nightstand as well. There is 13 inches of clearance under each bed so that you may store your luggage there easily. We were able to fit two rolling duffels without any difficulty. What we usually do is travel with a carry-on backpack and we usually store our carry-ons inside our rolling duffels and then place them under the bed. Here you're looking at us store our luggage underneath our bed in our deluxe veranda cabin, but all of the beds on Viking are the same and have the same amount of clearance. The closet is the same size as other cabin categories. However, in the ADA cabin, there are additional shelves that are open, and there is plenty of room to navigate a wheelchair between the bed and the closet. But inside you'll find a small top shelf, plenty of hangers, robes, slippers, and an umbrella for your voyage. On the other side of the closet, you'll find another area to hang your goods, although it's not as long of an area. There's another shelf and also three additional drawers. As we head around the corner, you'll find another area that includes a Nespresso Krups coffee maker as well as a selection of coffees that are replenished daily. You will find another shelf. Your safe is located here as well as additional drawers to store your items. The safe fit all of our necessities including two tablets, a 13-inch laptop, our passports and wallets. Inside these drawers you'll find a lint remover, a shoehorn, a bag for laundry service as well as your blow dryer. You can easily move these if you want to store some of your clothes in here. There is a full-length mirror next to this area. There is a sliding door and a flat surface to enter the accessible bathroom. The bathrooms that you will find on the Viking ocean ships are by far some of the nicest bathrooms that we've ever had at sea. And the handicap accessible bathroom is no exception. You will find that overall they are very spacious and well lit. The vanity and sink have had some of the shelving removed so that individuals in wheelchairs can use the vanity without difficulty. There is an anti-fog, well-lit vanity mirror, as well as one additional long drawer for storing toiletries. There are grab bars around the commode as well as one adjustable grab bar between the commode and the shower. There is a flat surface for entering the shower, as well as grab bars in the shower, a broad shower curtain, 
and a shower chair that folds out from the wall. Shampoo, conditioner, body wash, body lotion, and bar soap by Freya, which is Viking's own line, are provided. There are additional shelves recessed on each side of the sink as well. One of our favorite things in the bathrooms on Viking Ocean Ships are the heated floors. Because of the sliding bathroom door, there are no hooks located on the back side of the door. The hooks instead are located next to the commode. There is a retractable clothesline in the shower. But laundry facilities on board Viking Ocean Ships are free of charge and we will show you those in a second. There is a handheld shower head option. There is a folding shower chair in the shower, but if this is inadequate for you, ask for a shower chair from your room steward or ahead of time on my Viking journey. Viking Cruise Lines is really not one of the preeminent cruise lines known for accommodating passengers with disabilities. Passengers must notify Viking Cruises of their condition at the time of booking. This is the fit to travel form that must be returned to Viking within two weeks of receipt. After receipt of this form, Viking Cruises will determine whether the guest's needs can be accommodated. We highly recommend that you familiarize yourself with this form prior to booking. Climate control and light switches are located just inside the cabin entrance door. Now we love to take 100 pound magnetic hooks. We find this size is perfect for the items that we want to hang like jackets, bags, lanyards and more. Since they can be placed at any height, they may be very useful for a handicap accessible room. In this particular cabin, we recommend placing them either next to the shelves, at the wardrobe, or along the entrance wall. Self-service laundrettes including complimentary detergent are located on almost every deck that has staterooms. Laundrettes are not accessible for those in wheelchairs. But fortunately, the Penthouse Junior Suite comes with complimentary laundry, dry cleaning, pressing, and shoe shine services. Overall, the ADA compliant Penthouse Junior Suite is a testament to the impeccable craftsmanship, attention to detail, an unwavering commitment to guest satisfaction that define Viking Ocean Cruises. Please enjoy our other Viking Jupiter cabin reviews, including a deluxe veranda, penthouse veranda, penthouse junior suite, and two different explorer suites. We hope you're enjoying our reviews of the Viking Jupiter. Please remember to subscribe or give us a thumbs up as your support makes a difference. Always remember to make meaningful and healthy travel happen and we'll see you next time.